Windsor Castle, the oldest and largest occupied castle in the world. Now that spring has arrived, changing the guard takes place every morning, encompassing wonderful spectacle and British pageantry. It's a chance for onlookers and tourists to be reminded of the special relationship between the state and Her Majesty's armed forces. Little do they know, however, that inside, a 27-year-old paratrooper is being awarded for utmost bravery and courage whilst on his tour of duty in Helmand. On what should have been an ordinary patrol, Lance Corporal Josh Leakey's actions were so extraordinary that he's now behind these doors, receiving Britain's highest award for battlefield gallantry. And it makes him the only living British recipient of the Victoria Cross during the Afghanistan campaign. Lance Corporal Josh Leakey was the first of today's recipients to receive his award from Her Majesty in the Waterloo Chamber, a state room decorated with royal military portraits and dominated by an image of the Duke of Wellington, former head of the army. In his citation for the honour, it read that Lance Corporal Josh Leakey had showed complete disregard for his own safety as the patrol came under attack from around 20 insurgents, armed with machine guns and rocket-propelled grenades. During the incident, he took command of the situation, giving first aid to a wounded US officer and leading his evacuation before returning to the fight. On two separate occasions, as bullets flew dangerously close, he retrieved machine guns and took the battle to the Taliban, rallying the troops around him. But as always, Lance Corporal Leakey played down his actions, paying tribute to his comrades. Everyone on the ground that day were sort of moving around and it just so happens that I'm the one who's been given this award to represent all of, all of those people and to, you know, to represent my whole, my unit and my battalion and uh, my regiment throughout the whole campaign really. That's, that's how I'm looking at it. Since the Second World War, only 15 Victoria Cross medals have been awarded and amazingly one is already in the Leakey family. Lance Corporal Josh Leakey's second cousin twice removed, Sergeant Nigel Gray Leakey, was a posthumous recipient of the Victoria Cross in November 1945 for his gallantry while fighting in Africa during the Second World War. Before it happened, I didn't wake up in the morning and think, oh, this guy got a VC in the war. You know, it's, it is what it is, and he was just another soldier in his regiment doing his bit, and that's what he'd say if he was alive now. Being recognised for his actions in Afghanistan is a significant event for Lance Corporal Josh Leakey, but he just calls it a normal day. What's most important for him, above everything else, is doing his job and being a para. Being in the parachute regiment for me is like what my life is about. It's the only thing, it's the only job I've ever had. Uh, it's not even a job, it's my life. Um, you know, I absolutely love being in the parachute regiment and that's what I want to continue doing.